Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Tidbits Snacks to Go. Uh, this is caramel coated peanut butter crunch, just the original. Mine is with pretzel and with cocoa. These were $3 each at Marshall's. Um, what's funny is we have reviewed another brand called Tidbits. So if you look on the channel, uh, you'll probably see this uh, on several things uh, because I, I don't know how companies can use the same name, but there's literally another company called called Tidbits. I guess it's um, called Tidbit Snacks to Go. I guess Tidbit Snacks to Go, but uh, yeah, but the main Tidbits, it's that's the primary thing you see on them. It amazes me that uh, different companies are allowed to have the same name. Uh, but these are distributed by New Twist Food in Brooklyn, New York. Uh, so it says delicious popcorn dipped in decadent caramel and coated in rich peanut butter, the real kind. A perfect blend of sweet and salty, smooth and creamy, followed by a fluffy crunch. Four servings are in the container. A one third cup, 30 grams, is 110 calories. So it's a small bag. It's a small bag. You'd have to weigh these. Oh, no. Oh, it smells like a uh, peanut. Yeah. Yeah, it smells like raw well, peanut. I like the texture. Mm -hmm. It has, um, it's very crunchy on the outside, but it's not hard like some caramel corns are. Mm -hmm. This is a nice crunch. I feel like we've had this before. Mm -hmm. Tastes very similar to something else. Yes. Maybe those little peanut like puffs, but these are crunchier. The flavor right. is similar. What are those called? Like Bomba or something? Mm. I think these are, this is sweeter. It is definitely sweeter and yeah. crunchier. Because that is a truly a raw peanut flavor. Um, this is good. This, I really do like the crunch of it. I mm. like the peanut coating. Um, yeah. the, the only thing is, you're going to want to eat that whole bag. I, I would definitely eat the whole bag. Yeah, and, and, and that's going to be what? 440 calories. 400, yeah, 440 calories, which isn't bad if you want to make a meal of it. Um, uh, but they're good. They're delicious. It's a very good I would, want to eat more. Yes, I would probably half that bag. Eat half one night, half the next Yeah, night. I would have to put it in a bowl and take it with me. Uh -huh. If I took the bag with me, it's gone. The bag's going to be gone. Because <laughs> it is sweet. It is delicious. It's very, very good. Now, so, I love the lingering peanut butter flavor, too. So, this is the same thing, except with pretzel. Yeah, they got to oh. mix in. they got to be stuck. Oh, this is not what I expected at all. Mm -hmm. I thought the pretzel was going to be in the thing. Like stuck to Like it? stuck, like crumbles of pretzel stuck. Is it just loose in there? Yeah. I wouldn't it's have bought them. Like a mix. I wouldn't have bought them. I didn't know. Yeah, look. So it's the same darn thing well, we just covered. tried. They got some coating. Okay. Let's see. I'm trying to get another pretzel out. So this is delicious popcorn and pretzels dipped in decadent caramel coated in rich peanut butter. It's the same thing. Mm -hmm. You're just supposed to eat a pretzel with the popcorn, but guess what? You're not getting enough pretzel to get one with each piece of popcorn. Not really. No, not at all. Good little well clean. Eat, eat that with a piece of popcorn though. Don't oh. need about that. So. Okay. I tell you what, the one thing that the pretzel does, it adds some salt to it. I mean, there are a lot of pretzels down there at the bottom. Look at that base. I like it. If you, I mean, I like this one just as well, but it does. It, it does seem saltier. It does add flavor to it. Mm -hmm. Um, I just I, there there should be enough to kind of give you equal parts though. Yeah, there are pretzels down in the bottom, but it does not look like there's enough pretzels. There's an equal ratio. Um, the, but I mean, the whole, even the popcorn itself, when you eat just the popcorn, it seems saltier. Um, I like that salt. Mm -hmm. I'm left in my, yeah. I'm left with salt. Yeah. That's what I'm left with after having that. I, mean, I, I didn't really get that with this. No, this I didn't. This is more peanut. I agree. I didn't get the salt at all. So now I'm still getting salt. Mm -hmm. So honestly, I'd pick these. I would too. Those are worth getting because you're getting more salt. Mm -hmm. um, 
And does it say what's, more salt on What's it? bad is that you're paying for it by weight. You're losing some popcorn in this because yeah. you're adding pretzels. Because you're getting those pretzels. Yeah, and pretzels are cheap. Um, it's over twice as much salt in this. This is 105. This one's 230. I'm still getting salt though. So to wow. me, that blue bag is worth it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I really but, like but it is twice as much salt. Okay, now wow. these. Now these are coated. Yes, these are uh, with cocoa. And it says award winning. I tell you what, if I won an award, I'd be putting it on the back of the bag somewhere. Like, these are distributed out of Brooklyn, New York. Like, they might have won, won some major award in Brooklyn, New York. I want to, to brag about that, so I would put that on my back. Food snack of the year or something Yeah, like a third cup, 30 grams, 130 calories. Still has a good texture. Yeah, but you don't taste the peanut butter now. Um, not, no, not really, not as much at least. Mm-mm. But I'm glad it didn't go like that dark baking cocoa kind of flavor. Right. It just has a cocoa flavor. It's not bitter. But it does end on a bite. There is a... Uh, a little bit. There, to me, it's left a funky flavor on my no, mouth. No, not me. Yeah. I'm just getting kind of that peanut butter saltiness. No, I'm not getting that. I'm getting... A, mm. I, I don't care for the cocoa itself. It... Um, it's fine while I was chewing it, but then uh, the leftover flavor... Um, I don't like it. it it's it's um, it's kind of funky. Now the one I just got was really dark. Yeah. I get it from that one. Okay. That's but the other ones that are light, I, I don't know. Okay. That, Maybe so. I just ate dark ones because that, that's exactly what it was yeah, like. Because the was... darker ones are really coated, I guess thicker with that cocoa. Yeah. They're okay. It still wouldn't be one I would pick. No, no. I would never pick that. Why would you? Why wouldn't you always pick your favorite? Right. Um, well, cocoa is never a flavor I'd, I would pick either. No. No. I just wanted to try it up against the other mm -hmm. ones. And they may have other varieties, although I can't imagine. I think if you um, like cocoa, you'll like that. Yes, definitely. If you like, like a little bit more of a dark. I cocoa. like cocoa, but it, that that one specifically is different for me. Yeah. It's not your. I don't think it's your ordinary cocoa. Um, I think both of these are really good, though. I do too. But if you can get that blue bag, the one and with pretzel, I mean, even though I'm like, oh, you know, I was disappointed that it wasn't on the the piece of uh, popcorn. Um, it still has all that salt and mm -hmm. which makes it absolutely delicious because you keep getting that salt yeah. um and the pretzels themselves actually have a coating on them as well they do they Maybe do it could be just falling off but still it's still on there yeah so so yeah so that they didn't just put it on the popcorn they put it on the pretzel too so i think that's the bag to get mm -hmm. now these i don't know why because these are perfectly the dates are great these have all had a red sticker on them, like they're marked down. Uh, so I don't know if that means they're going away from Marshalls, if they were on clearance or what. I have no idea. Um, but if you can find them, I would, I would definitely get them. Or maybe they were just priced too high and people weren't buying them. Could be. I don't know. Uh, but you'll have to let us know if you've ever tried them, ever seen them in your stores. Uh, I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.